Trivial. <laughs> but because they kept doing that, it's like, Terry, you, you should be enjoying this. You should be enjoying this. Yeah, I know I should be enjoying it. I should be. But Lord, and I, I got into a complaint. But Lord, and then I, you know. And I said, and then at some point, I shouldn't be here. This is evil. I shouldn't be here. But I couldn't get up. I just kept in that circle. Okay, at some point, I shouldn't be here. Yeah. Come back here. Until, like I said, the Lord, I find at some point this is so gone and recognizing, okay, no, Terry, this is evil. No, this is evil. Stop this. Okay, Lord, you're right. This is evil, Lord. How'd I get out? I, I know this is evil. I shouldn't. To, to say that despair says you, you're gone. Despair says there's no hope. So to, to be in despair says God isn't even around. He's gone. He's taking vacation. He's left me. But that's a lie. Yes, that's a lie. But my winds were boisterous. And I was reacting to my boisterous winds mm -hmm. with habit. Mm -hmm. Okay, now, we're going to broaden this out a little bit. I'll we'll come back to this in a second. The foundation to be offended mm -hmm. is that you exist. Mm -hmm. The foundation to be, for you to, for you to be offended, for me to be offended, I must still exist. Mm -hmm. Here's the problem. If we're a Christian, we're supposed to be dead. So if I'm offended, it says I'm not dead. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and if I'm not dead, I'm not working by the power of Christ. Because mm -hmm. the only way for Christ to work in me is that I'm dead. Mm -hmm. Which means I, I made myself a God. Mm -hmm. So the only way to be offended is that idolatry is present. Mm -hmm. Pride and lust is present. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's the foundation for all offense. Because notice what he says, you will deny me. And how do we deny Christ? We take our eyes off of him and focus on what's going on. Now, I started thinking. I said, Lord, well, I recognize this probably has, I, and we could create lots of categories, but this probably happens in three categories. And maybe in Tuesday we could cover more, but I think these three cover almost every reason we get offended. The first case is self. Mm -hmm. Right? Yes, now, 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 I, I, I want you to, if you're taking notes, I'm going to give you two subcategories of this first one. The first one is self. Mm -hmm. Okay? Now, we're told self is not just us. Mm -hmm. This is Luke 14, verse 26. Mm -hmm. We're told self is not just us, but it's all the people we love. Mm -hmm. That's okay. included in self. Come on, man. Mm -hmm. All right? So, our. Uh, our uh, vulnerability to being offended is either us directly mm -hmm. or the people in our inner circle. Amen. Those people we love. Mm -hmm. Spouses, Amen. children, mm -hmm. other family members, uh, friends, so on and so forth. Mm -hmm. These are people we tend to pray for every day. Amen. They're in our inner circle. Yeah, yeah. Technically, they really shouldn't be in the inner circle, but we'll get to that later. But they're in our inner circle. They're mm -hmm. special to us. Mm -hmm. All right? Mm -hmm. Now, Micah tells us something very interesting about this group. Go to Micah 6 for me. Old Testament, near back. Get past Daniel, you know, that's, I guess he considers one of the last major prophets. Go past Joel, Hosea, Joel. Go past Amos. Amos has some good things to say. Obadiah and Jonah. And finally get to Micah. And I'm just going to read a verse here in Micah chapter 6. No, I'm sorry. Uh, 7, chapter 7. Verse, verse 6. For the son, uh, let me start in uh, verse 5. Trust ye not in a friend. Trust ye not in a friend. Put ye not your confidence in a guide. Keep the doors of thy mouth from hurt and life in thy bosom. For the son is iron of the father, the father uh, rises up against her mother, the daughter in law against her mother in law, and man's enemies are the men of his own house. Now, 
<laughs> the way it's listed here, it's, it's those people that do something against you. Mm -hmm. And that's, ten, that, that's the way we, we think of enemy. Mm -hmm. But what if they're not doing anything? Mm -hmm. But because they're in my inner circle, they inadvertently cause me to care. And our habit of caring takes us from God. Our habit of what we call care mm -hmm. takes us out of God. Because we now worry. Let's, let's take someone who has an issue. Well, history says, okay, because they're close to me, I can worry about it. Mm -hmm. And we justify it. Well, that's my son. That's my daughter. That's my... Mm -hmm. Even God says, and he says, well, what about me? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. All right. Thank you. <coughs> Or something sad happens. Well, okay, I can be. It's, it's sad, so I, I can I can have sorrow. Mm -hmm. I can be sorry, be sorry for a whole week, and I'm justified because this event happened. And God says, okay, all right, I'll let you come out of that. Mm -hmm. Notice what I'm saying is, when people are close to us, we cancel God because I have an excuse. Mm -hmm. This is my spouse. This is my son. This is my daughter. This is my mother. This is my father. This is whatever. We make an automatic excuse, and we actually expect God to say, well done. Mm -hmm. But he says, no, you just denied me. Because mm -hmm. you, you didn't even come to me first. Mm -hmm. If prayer even happens, it's, it's after the fact. Thank you, Lord. He's like, well, you could have you brought that to me right off the bat. Mm -hmm. And given it to me. We're told to cast our cares upon the Lord. Mm -hmm. We don't cast. We, 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 uh, uh, if anything, we, attach it, we, we have a fishing line attached to it. <laughs> we dangle it to the Lord. And then if we think he's not working fast enough, we, we pull him back in. He's not working fast enough. He's Amen. busy. Enough. Let me help the Lord out. All right. See, this is the category that had me in my depression and despair. I had been praying for a member of the family, and in my opinion, the change wasn't coming. Your opinion. <laughs> That's all it is. It is my opinion. I mean, it wasn't the truth. Amen. All right. But we're not to judge by outward appearance. Amen. All right. So here Satan, mm -hmm. it's a, 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 the enemy part is understanding. Satan understands this person is close to you. Mm -hmm. He understands that this person, if they say the wrong thing, can ruin your day. Mm -hmm. He's mm -hmm. like, I got you. Amen. I'm going to have this person close to you say the most horrible thing to you. <laughs> and I, I got you for the rest of the day. Amen. Lord, mm -hmm. That's kind of what happened to me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because now, as opposed to recognizing, that wasn't that person saying that. That was Satan saying that. We don't go there. Mm -hmm. I can't believe this and that. That's all I've done. We go through all... Now, those who, who are we praising at this point? Ourselves. Mm -hmm. <laughs> We're the focus of our worship. We switch to worshiping God, supposedly, <laughs> and we switch to talk. Because mm -hmm. we've been so good to him. We've done, oh, we've done this. <laughs> we've done that. Oh, don't let it be a child of ours. Oh, my God. Oh, oh man. You know. And, you know, men can't do it, but women <laughs> carry that child for nine months. <laughs> and that's supposed to mean something. Mm -hmm. you know, and sometimes it's like, wait a minute. No. God can handle even that situation. Mm -hmm. But we don't go there first because we tend to do what habits says first. So we're talking about habits, or let's use a spiritual word, we're dealing with strongholds. Things in us that are against God that we still continue to do because we don't see it as evil. I stayed a whole day in depression because for a while it was okay. It was justified. And by the way, if you're in depression and despair, and it's a person causing it, <coughs> hate and judgment are right there too. No matter what they do, you're like, mm -hmm. I mean, you can't see good in that, nothing they do. You can't see good in nothing they do. And that's all was yesterday. I mean, the whole day. As God just kept my two sons just playing with me and, and loving on me and <laughs> just kept kept them going all day long. And I'm trying to get away. <laughs> so category one is when we allow ourselves, whether that be truly ourselves or those close to us, mm -hmm. to take us from God. Because mm -hmm. mm -hmm. we, we don't believe and mm -hmm. it's not conscious. Mm -hmm. it's, it's habit. Yeah. We we I got I gotta deal with this. Yeah. 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 That's true. And I'm like, you, you do? Yeah. What, what, what? Hmm. Where's that? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. Have it. Thank you. Second category, category, still people, just other people. Mm -hmm. They're not close to us, but <laughs> they can cause us to leave God quick. <laughs> <laughs> right? It might be colleagues at work. 